Back home. Wait a minute. Do we have some new neighbors moving in? This is perfect. Hi there. Finally, some more people moving into this neighborhood. So it's not so empty around here. Hey, y'all. I'm finally back. The traffic was crazy. Oh, hey, Akila. Hi, mommy. Hey, did you see that we have some new neighbors moving in next door? Yeah, me and Leah saw them unpacking. Okay, well, we should definitely go introduce ourselves. About time, too. I know, right? I was just saying that this neighborhood has been real empty. Come on, Leah, you have to come with us. Do I have to? Yes, Leah, it's the polite thing to do. Come on, you can get back to jump roping afterwards. Okay. It will be quick, Leah. Yeah, no longer than like 10 minutes. Come on, let's go. I'm so excited. Hey there, we saw you unpacking and we just wanted to stop by and say hello. Aw, what a lovely family. Oh, we're the Collins family. My name's Akila. this is my husband August, and our daughter Leah. Oh, hello, my name is Betsy Jefferson. By the way, how much money do y'all make? Um, what? Just kidding. Oh, uh, yeah. Ha ha. Oh, I have a son that's about your age. Oh, okay. Good for you. Leah, be nice. Well, um, where is your son? Yeah, where is he? Oh, um, he's probably just checking out the neighborhood. Oh, okay, yeah, um, there is a lot to explore, so I don't blame him. And you know, kids are very curious. Anyways, do you think you need any help moving in all those boxes? Oh, no, no, it's okay. No, it's all right, we insist. I mean, you're doing this all by yourself. You know what? Um, sure. I'm just used to doing everything on my own. <laughs> one or two won't hurt. Okay, um, I'll get this one on top of the car. Don't want it to fall off or anything. All right, well, let's bring these inside. How are you liking the neighborhood so far? I really don't feel like helping this lady right now. I could be jump roping. Whatever, we're almost done, so let me go ahead and just grab this box. Oh, you must be Betsy's son. I'm Leah. I know your name already. I was watching you from the tree. <laughs> from the tree? What are you doing, you weirdo? Enjoying some vitamin D. You can never get enough. So, um, what's your name? My name is Freddy. <sniffs> mm. Mom, Dad, get out here now. Here we go again. <sighs> Leah, what is it? Yeah, what's going on out here? Um, ma'am, is this your son? Hello, hello. Oh, yeah. Well, hello. Um, hi. Now, Leo, what was all that screaming about? What happened? He's being weird. Nothing happened. Um, why are you saying nothing happened and she's saying you're being weird? Everything is a-okay. Liar. She's the weird one. Somebody lying. Yeah, um, she sniffed my hair. Now I know that is something my daughter would not do. Excuse me? She can't get over my new conditioner. Why would I ever? That doesn't sound like Leah. I'm saying something is definitely off. Leah, you can go ahead and put that box down because I don't really know what's going on here. Freddy, you can't act like this every time you move somewhere new. Every, every time? time? I think this is all a huge misunderstanding. He's done this before. Sorry about him. Um, it's okay. Uh, maybe we should just, uh, you know, get going now. Come on, Leah, let's go. No, don't leave. Um, you know what? Uh, we can come by later with, uh, with a home-cooked meal. Just so you know, welcome y'all into the neighborhood. I'll, I'll whip something up. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, well, bye, see you later. I won't be coming back, thank you. All right, come on, y'all, let's, let's get inside. <laughs> um, that was so weird. 
Okay, so we're back inside and and I'm trying to think about what I should bring them. A pie sounds good. Yeah, but I did say that I would make them a home-cooked meal, so they might be expecting food. But for me, of course. Oh, of course he meant for you. I'm just gonna go ahead and make some lasagna. Yeah, that'll be good. Oh yeah, this is gonna be really tasty. Okay, let me go ahead and add the finishing touches before I go ahead and put it in the oven. Mom, what was wrong with that kid? He's so weird. Honestly, honey, um, while me and your dad were helping her put her boxes inside, she did kind of tell us that her son is socially awkward and I know that it was probably really creepy and I'm not expecting you to be his friend or anything, but maybe we should try to just be a little nicer because we don't know them and what they've been through. Also, it turns out that they're renting the house. They're not even buying it, so they probably won't even be here for long. Here, let me put this in the oven. I'm going to my room. Have fun. Well, okay then. Perfect. I guess we can go and just chill while we wait for this to bake. This is going to be the perfect spot for the show. Okay, it's time to just have some good vibes with some good music. What was that? Did I just hear something outside? Oh my gosh. Ready? How long have you been out there watching me? Fancy seeing you here. <laughs> you come here often? You're so scary. Leave me alone. You know what? Matter of fact, stay right there because I'm telling my brother. Oh no, not her big brother. I need to get out of here. Ow, my back! Ow! Ow! Leo, the boy next door was spying on me in my room! Wait, what'd you say? The boy next door was spying on me! He climbed in the tree and he was watching me dance in my room! Huh? Leah, are you sure? Leo, I'm sure! You have to go beat him up or something! Uh-oh. Hey, four eyes. N me No, because this has to be a prank, right? What the heck are you doing spying on my sister? I would never do such a thing. Dude, you literally have binoculars around your neck. Can I just go to my house, please? And what's that smell? Yeah, I smell it too. Human fecal matter is perfectly normal. Nothing to be ashamed of here. Get out of here, you creep. Ew! Ayo! Hey, Ain't no way! Freaking weirdo, man! Come on, Leah, let's go. That's nasty. Okay, kids, don't worry. Everything is gonna be okay. We're gonna get this figured out. Okay, August, you can go and knock on the door. Dang right I'm about to go knock on this door! Put the wig on. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. What's that noise in there? Okay, so after knocking forever, they finally came out. But, um, what is going on here? Uh, why does Freddy look like that? I'm, I'm a little scared. Kids? Uh-uh, step back. We're gonna call the cops on y'all. What do you want? Man, what the heck? Are we getting punked? I, I don't even know. Freddy? Can someone please explain what's going on here? Young kids nowadays, just dumb as can be. That is not a child, that's a grown man. Get away from my husband, I mean son. What's going on here? Nah, y'all got something real weird going on. So y'all stay right there, cause again, we're calling the police. Get out of my way and no one gets hurt. No one gets hurt, little man, what are you about to do? Boy, not you being the same height as my 10 year old daughter. Oh my gosh. Now what are you gonna do? Oh no, we gotta go. What do you mean you have to go? You just moved in. What? Wait, what are you doing? Oh no, nah, back up from my wife. Freddy, get in. Where are y'all going? Why do you, what? What in the world? This can't be real. Oh my. 
my gosh, I can't believe they really just got up and left. Look, y'all, there's the car right there. No, we have to call the police because this is weird. Oh my gosh. Yeah, um, let's just go ahead and get inside. They can't just get away like that. Okay, well, we're not following them. Like I said, we'll go in, call the police. Right, and lock these doors. Come on, let's go. What the heck? Oh my gosh. I think we can all agree that we have not had a crazy day like this in a while. You can say that again. That was weird. Weird is an understatement. And I don't even really know what happened with that situation. But let me just go ahead and start getting ready for bed. Because I need to go to sleep. I'm just glad that the creepy neighbors next door are gone. Breaking news. And you might want to buckle your seatbelts. Because it's a wild one. Con artist Mary Bell and Clarence Stewart have been arrested. Akila? Uh, come here. They're known for dressing up as mother and son and moving into different neighborhoods to get close to families and then rob them for everything they have. They are very dangerous. They've been on the run for months now and they were just arrested near the Blocksburg exit tunnel when police initially pulled them over for a broken headlight. They've been taken down to the station and held for booking. What? They dress up as mother and son and rob people for what they have? Excuse me? Wait a minute. So you mean to tell me that that little boy who was spying on our daughter was not a little boy? No, that was a grown man. Oh, nah, they definitely not getting that lasagna. Not you being worried about the food. I'm just glad the kids are okay. What a really crazy day. I hope you enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. There's nothing